guys and girls and thank you for watching another episode of the xbox tester my name is maurice today we are gonna play metal slug metal slug one on the xbox series s so this is a uh, part of the arcade collection archives neo geo and um yeah let's just dive in first of all let's see how much data it is it's only 206.4 mb uh it is of course installed on my ssd i did these games are not that expensive seven or eight yeah seven euros buy them when they're cheap there are a lot of these games and um, i will probably do a few more i don't think i'm gonna do all of them because there are like 50 or so but yeah let's go start it up you guys if you like this kind of content don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel it means a lot for me you're really helping out the channel you can also hit the bell icon i upload almost on a daily basis new games old games updates on games and a little bit of hardware here and there so let's start up metal slug i love these games i really do it's i don't know why but I knew back then when the Neo Geo AES came out, it was too expensive for me. This console was one of the most expensive consoles ever made. I think it was like, yeah, almost like, like, what? Five, six hundred euros back then when it first came out. So, yeah, this, this console was... Too expensive and i think these games were like two three hundred bucks each and if you 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 need to watch those things on google there's like this big they're, they're really big cartridges it's insane but it was the only console that could actually handle the original arcade hardware of the game and it's still sought after i i did own a neo geo but i sold it because somebody really wanted to pay me a lot of money for that thing and yeah i just did it it was a lot a lot of money they wanted to pay me for it And still, these cartridges are super expensive, if you can find them. So, to play these games on a... And these are actually pretty well... Uh, how do you say that? Um, ROMs for the system, because uh, it's not... Yeah, they're not upscaled, they're just like, this is it. This is what you get. What you see is what you get. And to be honest, yes, the original software of source of hardware is still more cool to play on. Yeah, 100%. If you have the chance to play this on original hardware, do it. If you don't have that option, then this is the best secondary option to get. How cool is this? You even got some extra uh, things going on. You can uh, display settings. Frame of the display, position of the display. You can put a wallpaper on. Uh, screen filters. I don't really like screen filters to be honest. Wider screen. Oh, that's, that's okay.
Mission complete. Do get some black bars, I think. Yeah. But how cool is this? I think it's so amazing. See those guys falling down. Oh my goodness. Ah, ah. And these games are super hard, by the way. But look at these backgrounds. I, I really dig it. I really love it. Because did these things were impossible to to run on a Super Nintendo or something like that. Maybe like the PS1. Even the PS1 had some difficulties running games like the these. This is so much. These games are way too much fun. And you know what? What's even more fun? Play it with a friend. Play these games go up. Oh my goodness. You will have a blast. Jumping tanks. I even had the, the Neo Geo Pocket Color. I don't know if anybody of you guys know about that console. That was an amazing Game Boy uh, console. Way better than you would expect. And I also had like uh, these, these games on it. Metal Slug. There was even a Sonic on that game, on that console. Really funny console. Yes, I did it. But yeah, you guys, this is Metal Slug on the Xbox Series S. And these games are just way too much fun. So go check it out when they're uh, cheap, when you can get one of these cheap, buy them. There are like four, five Metal Slug games 
buy them. They're they're super cool. You guys, I really want to thank you for watching this episode of the Xbox Tester. Hope you had fun. Hope to see you guys soon in another one. Bye.